Hi, it's Ralph here. This quarter we acknowledge very serious shortcomings in the way ING Netherlands executed policies to prevent financial and economic crime. We paid a large fine following investigations by Dutch authorities, reflecting how serious these shortcomings were. We have accepted full responsibility for what went wrong. We should have done better, much better. We now need to look forward and make sure we get it right. At ING Netherlands, we're taking important steps to structurally improve compliance risk management. And we're working with the Dutch Central Bank to further strengthen our compliance culture and awareness. We strongly believe that integrity is essential to the way we conduct our business everywhere and the way we serve and empower our customers. They showed in the third quarter as we continued looking for new ways to improve our customers' experience, like with a new contact center platform. For example, if you're chatting via computer to a call center agent and you need to leave, the agent can switch your conversation to the phone with just one click. The rollout starts this year in three retail banking markets and I expect all 12 to use it by the end of 2020. Another big milestone is about climate change and what we as a bank are doing to help fight it. We announced that we'll begin steering our lending portfolio. Now it's 600 billion euros to help keep the rise of global temperatures to well below two degrees Celsius. This makes us the first bank to commit to using science-based scenarios to reach that goal. And hopefully many other banks will follow. That's all we have time for. Thanks for watching. See you next quarter.